conozco hasta la más íntima parte ¿Cómo es posible que me digas que lo amas cuando yo sé que soy el dueño de tu cama? Hi guys and welcome back to my channel and if you are new thank you thank you so much for tuning in um you guys will probably hardly be able to hear me because we are in san pedro um we came out here to try out their food well no not try out their food to eat some of their food and probably go on a boat ride we're probably we're just gonna see though if it's like possible if they have them available for today because i don't know if it's only like on the weekends that they have the boats available or not um we already went ahead and ordered our food uh, what we usually get when we come down here to San Pedro is the tray for two people, which that shit, it is bomb. Like, if you guys have not been out here, you definitely need to try it out. It's in the city of San Pedro, and it's like a fish market where they sell you, like, fresh seafood, um, and it's fucking bomb as hell. We did bring Melody along with us this time, uh, since it's Tuesday, she does get out of school early, so she already got her food. Let me see. This is what she got. It's like a shrimp cocktail, and this is, like, the small, so... It, has a, it looks like it has a lot of shrimp, so it's not bad. And I think it was only like 10 or $13. We're just waiting for our food now. I'm freaking hungry. We haven't ate all freaking day. I noticed that whenever summer starts kicking in or whenever it starts getting hot, like I don't get as hungry in the mornings as I typically normally do. But And it's already what? What time is it right now? It's probably already like 3 o'clock right now. We haven't ate all freaking days. I'm starving. Babe went to go get us some drinks right now. I wanted a pina colada and I think she's gonna get a michelada. This is our view. I like this right here because it's like so close to the water. And if you come on a weekend, if you come on a weekend, you do not get to like sit this close because it's always so freaking packed right here. Yes, I brought a blanket because if we get on the boat, I know my ass is gonna be cold to ask. Not that cold. And our drinks are here. I know, I know. That's a michelada. This is a whole big ass cup. Look. My hand is like right here. So it's like so huge. And then this is my. Um, what did I get? Oh, pina colada. Look at this. It's so like well decorated. How is it good? Yeah. How's your food? I'm good. Okay. My pina colada is fucking good. Maybe the fact that this one actually has alcohol. Oh my god. It is so good. She is digging into that pina colada. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, she's digging into the pina colada. Do not drink if you are under the age of 18. Look, I see babe coming. And our food is here already. Oh my god, it looks so bomb, y'all. I'm gonna show you guys right now. Look, we got the tray for two people. Oh my god, this is fucking delicious. It looks so good, especially because I'm so hungry. If you guys come out here, you guys definitely need to get that tray. It's for like two people. They do have like options for like three to six people or more, but we always just get for two people because it's just me and her. I don't know if Melody's gonna try this, but I know I am. Here you go, babe. Grab this. Okay, so we are done eating. We're gonna go ahead and get on the boat now just that there's no drinks allowed so we need to like hurry up and finish our alcohol because i don't know they just don't allow drinks in oh my god <laughs> i hope i don't get seasick at all yeah okay <sighs> oh my god okay you guys so we're getting on the boat now and then i let me bring my drink up with me hello they have like munchies on there too how exciting and this is like our first time getting on a boat together. So I think the guy said it's still like a 10 more minutes for them to start, like for them to board more people onto the boat. So we're just waiting until the boat takes off. And in the meantime, I'm gonna go ahead and try to finish this. Can't wait till it starts moving. Walk around and explore the area. You cannot walk around and explore the area. Why? You're on a boat. You can walk, but. Oh, on the boats, Friday? Yeah. But it's dangerous because the boat moves. So you have to hold on. I want to see the seals. They're going to be like... That's even if you see any seals. Yeah, because sometimes they're there, sometimes they're not. Oh. Okay, while we wait on the um, boat to take off, we're going to come down here because we saw that they sell some munchies. That pina colada got me a little bit. I'm a little bit buzzed. Okay, so let me see what they have to munch on. It's moving. No, it's not. I'm like desperate for this thing to move, you guys. Look, now it is moving. Yeah, well, I think we're taking off now. Okay. 
The boat is moving. <laughs> There's one, I don't know if it's in Long Beach, but they go really fast. It's called a speed one, and you get with it for adults because kids, oh. when they bounce, they fly out. <laughs> I'm like, Melody, it was nice having you. you. Have to have yeah. Let's go, yeah. So we're gonna go ahead and walk towards the front. I know. It could be like, like this, dude. <laughs> Bye, guys. Hey, hey, you want to see my stack? It's my stack. And a tour around the Port of Los Angeles. And it is the crew working with us today downstairs on deck. The first officer and captain is Mike. Mike is downstairs. You're walking around. If you need some help, you can talk to Captain Mike. He'll be glad to help you out there. Come in our snack bar. Aquí voy a hacer mi. Mi Titanic momento. Me voy a poner aquí. Me falta la canción. No, Dios mío. Coming up here to the right, the pink salmon color building, the municipal fish market, the 40 thieves when the boats go out and catch fresh seafood. They come back to the pier to offload. That's the building here to the right. And they got small items like anchovies and squid, sardines and mackerel. They'll use those hoses, drop them into the fish hole, back in to catch off the boat, put it in a metal box or plastic bin, pack it full of ice, drag it through the building, put it on a semi truck or a box truck and send it on to the processing center. The first step in the chain of commercial fishing, though, to supply a vessel from World War II. The lean victory did go out and support our troops carrying three wars. World so War II, the Vietnam conflict, and the Korean War. Though. The ship is 455 feet long. It is a funny museum here in the port of Los Angeles. You go down to the end of the peninsula, get on board the lane victory, yeah. walk around and see what life used to be like on a living, working merchant supply vessel from World War II. Something <laughs> you've never done on a boat. Dance! <laughs> I've never been on a boat. It's your first time on a boat, I know. Is your first time like eating a on a boat? Is your first time being on a boat? It's your first time dancing on a boat. <laughs> look, there's a horn. You can like see the water. Yeah, but if you look off to our right hand side, that blackish gray line, that is a rock wall known as the Federal Breakwater. The Federal Breakwater starts off on the right where it meets land. That's Cabrillo Beach San Pedro comes out here in front of us to They're the white white structure. There. That's the Los Angeles oh. Lighthouse. There's an opening or a break in the wall. That's Angel's Gate. It's the entrance to the Los Angeles Harbor. As you can see the big ship coming through right now. Construct the rock wall. They started it back in 1899. They completed oh construction in 1949. I saw a butterfly. <laughs> <And> my grandma. <laughs> <laughs> I thought I was going to get sick, but I don't. I'm Probably because we're full. Because we ate. Well, I don't know. Butterflies literally like, like flying. They're going right there. Oh, I know. In the water. If I was a shark or a fish, I'd swim up and eat it. What the hell? <laughs> Is I eating a piece of grass for them? <laughs> Back to the spot we usually come to. We're always here, like, all the time. <laughs> I'm gonna make this our anniversary spot since we always come here. <laughs> I'm just playing, yeah. <laughs> Be careful not to fall, Melody. These stairs are fucking steep, y'all. Fucking jungle, hot to jungle, I win. Me caigo, como cagada. Look at the lonely child. Do, do, do. Looking for somebody. She was looking for Roxanne. <laughs> she thought she was alone. <laughs> oh, look, somebody was smart. <laughs> they fixed the little steps. Let me go ahead and help them out by adding a a little uh, rock to their step there we go <laughs> you're not cold the water's not cold Stopped at Starbucks. I'm gonna. I want to try that Cloud Nine uh, Macchiato. I think I don't know if it was Ariana Grande who came out with it or what, but I want to try it. No. <laughs> 